Hi, my name is Abdul Rahman from Maple Systems and I'll be going over the BCD conversion instruction in this video tutorial. First, let's go over to an empty subroutine and hover over the conversion tab. Now place the BCD conversion instruction on the first rung. Now that we know where the instruction is located and what it looks like, let's go over to screen number 8 and place the appropriate ladder logic subroutine on the right hand side of the screen. Let's take a moment and discuss what exactly BCD means and how it works. BCD stands for binary coded decimal. It's just another way that we can represent numeral values in binary form. Let's pull up a white screen and illustrate what we mean. A BCD is a digital encoding method for a decimal number in which each digit is represented by its own binary sequence. In BCD, a numeral is usually represented by a 4-bit binary number where the range is between 0 and 9. So if we observe the decimal number 54, a binary representation of this value is 00110110. But for a BCD representation, the 5 and the 4 will break up into its own digits. A 5 would be represented by its 4 bits 0101 and a 4 represented by its 4 bits 0100. So together they are 0101-0100 but if we read this value in normal binary form it's the decimal value 84 but in BCD it's 54. Now let's go to the ladder logic subroutine and examine the first rung. Operand A takes in a register containing the binary or decimal value. The value in operand A is then converted into binary coded decimal or BCD and placed in register defined by operand B. Operand A's value is not in the range of 0 and 9999. The conversion is not executed. The instruction turns on an error flag which is the bit S34. Now let's examine this latter instruction on the HMC. On the HMC, first let's input the decimal value of 54 and observe what happens. As you can see, the binary value is changed accordingly. Now let's press the convert button and observe. The corresponding BCD value here is changed to the binary value that was set. This is obvious. But notice the decimal value here. It's different than the one that we set. That's because we have broken up the individual BCD digits and displayed it in its own 4-bit binary numbers. So a 5 corresponds to these 4 bits and a 4 corresponds to these 4 bits and together they make up the decimal value of 84 which is apparent by this register value. Let's enter another value and observe. Now let's enter 10,000 for the binary register. This value is out of range. According to the instruction specification, let's press the convert button and observe what happens. And sure enough, the error flag bit turns on indicating an error with the logic instruction. Let's enter a valid number and see if the error goes away, and it does. And this concludes our video tutorial. For more information, please contact Maple Systems or visit us online at maplesystems.com.